What's up? It's your boy, King Bo, and I'm here to tell you a story today about when I fought my teacher. So let's get ready to turn up! So me and my friend Araya are going to Mr. Johnson's class. And after we get into this class, he stands at the door and tells everybody, hi, good morning, nice to see you, how are you? You look nice, your hair is nice, you losing weight, Schlemmer? You're losing weight, Schlemmer? You're losing weight, Schlemmer? He always says that to everybody. Shut up! All right, so he gets to Araya, he said, Araya, nice seeing you. How was your summer? How was your day? What did you do this summer? You do he was so nice and genuine to her, like, I don't understand why he has a problem with me, and I, I still don't to this day. So, I was coming to the door, and he mugged the spirit out of my solar system in my body. He said, oh, I got you again. Duh, you got me again, Mr. Bernardski! Yeah, I called you by your first name. I hope you see the video. Okay, let me delete my spirit, and let me get on to this conversation before I get upset. So I said, hi, Mr. Johnson. He said, huh, sit down, and don't cause no disruptions today. It's the first day of school. What am I going to do? So I go sit down at my desk. And Araya sits right next to me. You know, he comes in, he's like, well, hello, everybody. I just want to tell you, I'm ready for this year. It's exciting. Any questions? So I raise my hand, I say, Mr. Uh, Johnson, how's your day? He looks at me like the devil looks at everybody. He responds, shut up. I'm not talking to you. Matter of fact, get out of my classroom. Mr. Johnson, I was just asking the question. I thought you just said anybody can ask. I wasn't talking to you, was I? So shut up and get out of my classroom. I said, okay, Mr. Johnson. I was just asking a question. He said, are you back talking? And looked at me with this evil, evil, conniptioning spirit of eyes he had on the top of his face. And I said, you know what, I'm just gonna leave. And Araya was like, why is he so rude to you? I get up at my seat, I'm already sweating puddles and Hurricane Katrina down my tits as I get up, cause it's hot. It's hot as Satan's cornrows up in his body. I hear this like hot breath following me, like this hot breath from the gates of Hades follow me all the way to the door. And as I get out the door, he closes it and it's Mr. Johnson. He was like, I do not respect the fact that you come in my classroom and disrupt everything. I said, I'm not coming in your classroom disrupting everything because you just told us to ask you some questions to, you know, to get to know you. And I was just trying to, you know, ask you some questions. He said, I wasn't talking to you. I said, Mr. Johnson, like, why are you yelling at me? I haven't done nothing to you. He said, shut up. So this is the time where I got upset. And when I get upset, Mr. Johnson, if you're watching this, it's not a pretty sight, remember? Thank you. Um, wow, wow, wow. I got upset. And then I felt a little, a, I felt the little energy in my body because he screamed at me. Let me just walk away before I do something I'm going to regret. As I'm walking away, he says, where'd you go? I said, Mr. Johnson, I'm going to the office. It's the first day of school. I'm not trying to cause no drama. He said, drama? There ain't got to be no drama over here, baby boy. You ain't about that life. You don't know what I've been through. You don't know what hood I bang. You don't know what I do this. You don't know what I do that. You don't know how I do it. Okay? So shut up. And I said, shut up, Mr. Johnson, because I don't care about what hood you bang, boy. Because first of all, you ain't going to talk to me crazy. So when I did that, everybody heard it. I remember the security guard, Big Earl, we called him, because he was big. All he did was eat. E there will be 69 fights. Yes, I said 69 fights breaking out and all he's doing is stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. But let me get back to the story. <laughs> yeah. So everybody coming out there, I'm like, what's going on? Calm down, you guys. Please do not fight. It's the first day of school. Calm down. Everybody's huh? be happy. You know, everybody just calm down, please, for us. Please, or please. And Mr. Uh, Johnson was like, shut up. He ain't got nothing to do with you. It's between me and the fat kid. And I was like, all right, you ain't about to call me fat, Mr. Bigelow Johnson. First of all, you're built like a refrigerator. You try to call me fat, all right? You're about old as the Bible, and you want to talk about me? So what's up? Like, you've been out of problem me since third grade. Right? We freshmen now, boy. We freshmen now. So what's up? So he was like, boy, you think you're running something? You think you're running something? You think you think you're running something? I said, no, I don't think I'm running something. But you ain't going to talk to me like that. So he got crazy, and I got crazy, y'all. Hey, Amen. He ran up on me, and I punched his butt right in the throat, put my other fist down his spirit, and ripped out his evil soul, and threw it on across the ground. This man, I don't know where he got this strength from, picked up the most scariest. He picked up this dang chair and threw it at me. I said, oh, no, Mr. Johnson. Mm-mm, not to the king, baby. Not to the king. You've been deleted. Been deleted. You've been deleted. Mm-mm, not, not me, Mr. Johnson, baby. Not the king, baby. 
So he was like, all right, so what's up? And he throws the chair at me. And I tell you, I did the most Arabianic, most flexible, most spirit and natural somersault there is in the spirit of the land. So then after that, I took off with him. I said, bleh, 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 punch him in his face and in his noggin. Because I was very disappointed in him. Because he was actually a pretty good teacher. Now, he's fired. Out of nowhere, Mr. Johnson had the strength of Hercules and the strength of the devil at the same time. He slapped the soul out of my chest. I kid you not. He slapped the fat off my tits, the hairline off my head, and the air out my mouth. All I remember is being knocked out to the floor thinking that I was dead. But guess what, Mr. Johnson? I'm grown now, and I live in your state, boy. So if you want to meet up, comment below, and we can get things popping, baby.